hello friends today in, in this video we'll see how we can restore data or file structure from a vmdk file in many of the organization we have uh, block level backup so instead of and while restoring it we have to either promote as a new vm or the other way is to get the files from the vmdk file so today we will see how we can do it from a vmdk file so it is this is uh, my uh, server 2012 VM running on VMware Workstation 12. Now oh, let's go to File, Map a Virtual Disk, and uh, then browse to VMDK. Give the path where your VMDK file is present, and then click OK. It will take some time to read it. Great, so here we have two files. One is if system reserved 100 MP, and the other one is 80 GB of disk. <coughs> and here you have two options you can select or unselect this read only mode. But uh, since my intention here is to restore data, copy the data from the folder, so I will uncheck it. And you need not open here. So let's do OK. Just click OK for the warning. It will take some time to map it since the my VM since my VMDK file resides on network, so that's why it's taking a time. So now here we can see it has been mapped. Okay, just close it. Let's go to my computer. Now here we see eighty GB, eighty GB and F drive. Okay, so my I have to restore this folder, so let's copy it to any of your other drive. Since since the the file size is quite large, so it might take some time. Meanwhile, we can come here and verify. These all <coughs> are the data which was present on that VMDK file. So this is how you can restore files from VMDK without promoting it to a new VM in VMware. Thank you for watching the video. Bye bye. Have a great day.